our coverage with a free account on privacy, the service that keeps you protected when shopping online. Get $5 to try it now by using promo code QZZ2J. Hello, Internet. I'm Scott with Plug Hits Live, part of the Tech Podcast Network. I am here at Showstoppers as part of CES 2023, and I am at the Smarter booth, and we've got some interesting stuff. Uh, go ahead and introduce yourself for me. So my name is Christian. I'm the, the CEO and founder of Smarter. Okay. And uh, what have you got there in your hand? So this is actually a device called FridgeCam. And, and fridge cam pretty much does what it says on the tin, which is that it's a camera that goes inside your fridge. You pop it inside the, inside the fridge door, and as you close the door, um, it takes a picture and then sends it to your app. Okay. So, uh, so I imagine it's like in the, in the shelf on the door is probably the best place to put it? Yeah, you can put it either on the fridge door itself or on the shelf. Um, it's very easy to set up. It's got a one-click setup process. Okay. Um, you pair it with the app, and then immediately it will start tracking items inside your fridge so that it gives you a full inventory, and that prevents you from wasting food. So, okay, so it's giving you a full inventory. How does it do that? It, it actually uses uh, advanced deep learning. Um, it uses a, an algorithm and, and computer vision that detect the items inside your fridge. Uh, we've done quite a lot of training over millions of images, uh, and that gives you quite an accurate reading of what you've got inside. Okay, so, so are we able to get a feeling of that, that there's yogurt or that there's a particular type of yogurt? Like how detailed do we get on this? It's really um, down to user preference. Okay. So you could go as detailed as a, a particular brand. Um, we're doing a partnership with General Mills where they've obviously got a huge selection of brands. So some of your favorite products you can detect automatically. Um, if it's not in our database, then it will be a generic product. So it will just say yogurt or milk okay. instead of a specific brand. Okay, so if it recognizes the brand, it will grab it. But if not, it'll still be able to go well, that's, that's a gallon of milk. Yeah. We, we can detect milk pretty much if it's in a carton or a plastic jug. Okay. There's, there's millions of different points of data that we're kind of referring from. Okay. So it can be as detailed or as, as generic as you, as you really want it to be. Fascinating. So with a relationship with General Mills, uh, a lot of their stuff doesn't live in the fridge. Yeah. So we've actually got a product called uh, Food Camp. And, and food cam is a miniature version of this camera. It doesn't require uh, such a big battery. Obviously, with this being a product for the fridge, it's always in cold temperatures and you need quite a big battery to uh, maintain life. This one actually lasts for three months. Food cam mini is actually half the size of this and it sits inside your cupboard door okay. and it will detect all of your kind of uh, pantry items. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we can, do, we can do everything in the refrigerator and everything in the pantry. Exactly, it's exactly the same uh, recognition process. They work together, it's all working from one app. So you could actually have multiple cameras inside your kitchen. Works a little bit like Amazon Go where it's detecting what you do inside the kitchen. Um, so we basically, we use a, a, a feature called Kitchen Sync um, and that allows you to um, plug in different types of uh, sensor. So it could be uh, Amazon Alexa, for example. Okay. So you could say to Alexa, Alexa, I've run out of milk and that will go through Kitchen Sink and then into the app and then it all forms part of the same pantry management system. Um, so the camera is just one sensor as part of that entire ecosystem. Okay, Okay, that's fascinating. So you're taking regular photos. Are you also tracking how long things have been in the refrigerator? We, we use a, a kind of average expiry date. So we know that milk on average lasts a specific time. Um, and then we basically prompt the consumer that this item either hasn't moved for a long time um, or we know that it's been in your fridge for a couple of weeks and then we'll give you a reminder message to say probably time to clear out the fridge or this item probably needs to go in the bin. Um, we can send you messages if you're at the store. So if you're passing your local Walmart, it could say um, remember to pick up milk on the way home. Okay. So, so it is tracking time in the refrigerator or theoretically the pantry. It knows how long things last, and it'll even let me know when I go to the grocery store, your milk is probably bad, you should get some more. Yep, it uses, oh. it uses geolocation. So it will know if you're at the store and it will say, here's your shopping list of all the items that have been used up this week. It automatically keeps them in one place, 
Uh, so you don't have to make manual lists. Even better than that, you can um, get uh, meal suggestions or recipe suggestions. So it will say, you've got three items in your fridge. Um, why not buy flour or why not buy butter? And you can make this cake. Um, so that's really where the Sheffling software comes in into its own. Um, so the camera is really just doing the, 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 the part of the job where it's sensing what you've got. And then the, the software does everything else where it can um, essentially tell, tell you what you need after that. Oh. Okay, so it knows what I have. It can tell me recipes that I should use, possibly to use up things. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. So obviously there's a whole lot going on here. What's the price point on this guy? So uh, Fridge Cam 2 is retailing for $99. Um, it's going on pre-order very soon. Food Cam Mini, we're looking to go for a lower price point, so probably about $69. So uh, when is this coming to market? We're planning launching in the summer. Um, so it's going on pre-order in the next few weeks and then um, summer will be when it's available to ship. Very cool. So if people want more information about the product, which for sure they're going to want to, how can they get it? So they can go on to smarter.am, which is our website, uh, or our company, Sheffling.com. Uh, and Sheffling has all of the options for uh, recipe creation and, and meal planning. So that's actually a product that's available in the market now. Um, and you can download the app and, and start playing with the software um, that will accompany FridgeCam 2. Okay. And I plan on doing that uh, as soon as we leave here. So uh, thank you for taking the time to talk about this. This is super cool. Thanks very much, nice to meet you. For continuing CES 2023 coverage, stay tuned to pluckitslive.com slash CES.